just had absolute drama. Hello guys and welcome back to another session of Louis Cart Fishing Adventures. Today you join me at the famous Sandus Lake. Just drew about middle in the draw. So I picked peg 12, looking mega. Centre of the lake. Gears behind me, I'm absolutely far from walking all around there. But yeah, let's get the gear set up, chuck some rods out. Hopefully we can get a few Sandus bangers. three rods are on the spot. I've not gone real tight with the rods at the moment just to see what happens, see what spot's a bit better, but I've gone, there's a little tree there just to the left of the swim, so we can zoom in a little bit. But I've got one bang on the trees, the white bit of trees you can see, 16 wraps, one of rod length to the left and then another one rod length to the right of that. So um, yeah, probably put about 20 swans over the top, I'm just about to show you what I've put in and just chuck three bags on. <clears throat> so I've got fruit and nut boilies. I've got a kilo of crumb in there. OG fish, corn and pellet. A little bit of sauce. Back up boilies down there. Yeah, come on the car. Bosh. Right, just a little update on what's going on. It's now six o'clock. No more bites as of yet. Oh, I've redone the left hand and the middle rod because I've got taken out by weed but the rod's back out on the money put five more spawns over the spot oh fuck me and hopefully that can then toss a few boats in I'm gonna leave them now unless obviously I'll get taken out by weed again but um yeah come on my fucking nostrils that's beautiful mate no, look at it uh, sand, looking at least so, so I can try to touch the... The other side? Yeah, man. There it is. First sand, that's carp. The first carp of the straight through. It looks like guy over opposite me has got one on now as well. 28 pound. Absolute belter. Found some fruit and nut. A uh, bag of mini mix. Over over pink. OG fish pop up. Plug down so it sits like a wafter. Gosh. Just had absolute dramas. So I had the left hand and the middle rod, right, well, the middle hand rod in the water. I'm um, out of the water. It was just the right hand rod in. Started making fresh bags up, getting ready to chuck them back out again. And the right hand rod's bouted into action, flipped over, pulled my pod and my rod into the water. I've jumped in, fully clothed. Got absolutely soaked. Jumped in, fully clothed, picked into the fish. I was playing it for a couple of minutes, tried getting back out the water, back onto the bank, and I've had a hook pull. Absolutely good. All that effort for nothing, but it's a good sign that the fish are in my swim now. All three rods are back out on the money, and hopefully today we can get a few nosses on the bank. Bosh. Rods have been out a couple of hours now. Wind's been absolutely hacking down to the right hand side. I'm sure that the weed is dragged my rod's off the spot <clears throat> but I'm going to leave them there for another hour just to make sure I've got some fresh bags ready tied up to go on so I'm going to re-clip them maybe redo the line and that where I've been pulling it through the weeds it's getting a bit teared up so I'll just strip a few a few foot off it re-tie them onto the leaders get them out there nice and fresh I'm not going to bore you with all the updates but it's now 7 o'clock Nothing else has happened yet. It's been a quiet day. I've seen a few on the top throughout the weed, but they're just not interested in feeding. Hopefully, it's another repeat of this morning. Just once the temperature cools right down, I might get down, have a little five minute feeding spree. Hopefully, we can nick a couple, but until then, yeah, come on the carp. It gets worse and worse and worse. Just lost another one. Absolute belted off, left down rod again. Knew it was coming, there was only fish everywhere. Yeah, belted off, felt like an absolute belter as well. It was just a slow take and then absolute peeled off. Shot to the right, went into a big weed bed and then it just felt heavy. 
and then I thought we had it in, come in with a load of weed around it, but got closer than that and it was gone. The rod's back out on the money. That was a good sign, nice early bite. Hopefully we can get another couple more. Come on. Only five pounds, eh? What are we saying, George? That's light as fuck, like that's decent. Just see what the glare's like on the fish. Trot the front a little bit. Right, fish number two, 25 pound after losing two fish today. This one was definitely well deserved. And hopefully a few more tonight. Yeah, Let's spec. Right. Bang us. Back in the car now, on the way home. Fish started spawning again this morning for the fifth time down at Sandhurst. Absolute going mental, rods were getting taken out left, right and centre. The weed bed that I had in front of me, with the rain obviously that come out this morning. The water level rose and uh, the weed bed just shifted over, took everything out. It was absolute mental, so I um, just got the rods in. And um, yeah, just packed up, didn't get much footage obviously because of the rain. The camera was absolutely soaked. But, uh, thank you for watching guys. A couple of bangers in the mix. It wasn't too bad for my first time there. Next time we go again. I've got a bit more confidence next time because it's my first time fishing on a lake with that weedy. Yeah, happy days. Come on the car. Come on the park baits. Bosh.